Hey guys, this is Dr. Hub. In case you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe for updates. Let's look at the classification. And this is of the uh, lupus, lupus nephritis, and uh, it is in accordance with the International Society of the Nephrology and the Renal Pathology Society. So this is totally as per this. The class first one is the minimal mesangial lupus nephritis. As per this, the finding is it is a immune complex deposition in the mesangial without the structural changes in the light microscope. So there is no structural changes in the light microscopy. Next will be the mesangial proliferative proliferative uh, lupus nephritis. So this is nothing but the class two. There is a mesangial cell proliferation. So there's mesangial cell proliferation, and this is with the mesangial immune deposits. Next is the focus lupus nephritis. So as per this, there is a focal segmental glomerular nephritis involving less than 50%. So less than 50% of all glomeruli. The foci, focal endothelial deposits with or without the mesangial changes. Endothelial deposits. And this can be with or without the mesangial changes. Next is the diffuse lupus nephritis. The diffuse lupus nephritis is the class 4. So 3 was focal, the diffuse is tired, class 4. This is the most common and severe form of lupus nephritis. Very severe form of lupus nephritis, it's common. But the diffuse glomerular nephritis involves more than 50% of the glomeruli. The diffuse subendothelial deposits with or without the mesangial changes. So mesangial changes, it may or may not be present. There is presence of the distinct wire loop structure on the light microscopy. Next is we move on to the membranous lupus nephritis. So this is the class 5. There is a global and segmental segmental subepithelial immune deposits and this can be with or without the mesangial proliferation next is we move on to the advanced erosing lupus nephritis this is nothing but the class 6 so 5 is membranous class 6 is advanced sclerosing lupus nephritis there will be sclerosis and that is more than 90 percent of the glomeruli to learn and grow daily like this, please do subscribe.